Hi, hello. Really? How are you? Who are you? My name is Rita, and your dad has told me so much about you. Oh. Hey. Hey, baby. How are you? Oh, it's been ages since I last saw you. I'm so happy you invited me. And I've met your daughter, Luna. Luli, you got it right the first time. Oh. Right, Lily, she's so adorable. Mm -hmm. she yeah, is. she is. Hmm. Where is she? There's no food. What you eating? Please let me have some. Are you stupid? Move away from here. But I haven't eaten since that now. And how is that supposed to be my problem? Do I look like your mother? Get out of here before I slap this food on your face. Look at you. Give me food. Silly child. Hello, mom. Lily, whose phone is this? There's this auntie in the house and she's really wicked. She didn't let me eat any food. I haven't eaten since morning. Uh -uh. So is your dad not home? Yes. Uh -uh. But why would he live with a total stranger? You know what? I'm coming right now to get you. Okay. Lily, can you hear me? But why would she just hang up? Is that my phone? How did you get a hold of my phone? Who did you call? Tell me, what did you call? Did you call your dad to report me? I'm talking to you, come back here! Oh God, this girl is really stressing me out. Who did she call? She called her mom. Come back here, you little brat! so pretty. You little brat, what have you done? Uh-oh. Is that the dress you're wearing? Take it off right now. No. Don't make me repeat myself. Oh no, I heard you. <laughs> I said take it off. No, because my dad bought this for you. I can wear it anytime I want. Don't ah, make ah, me stop repeat it myself. Ah, take it ah, off. Ah, your stubbornness is getting on my nerves. I'm going to teach you a lesson. What is going on here? What are you doing? I will just straighten her hair. You're such an adorable princess. That's not true. You called me a little brat. Stop. And You're... you also hurt me. You peeled my ear. Why are you being overly dramatic? Tell your dad the truth. I even gave you ice cream today. That's not true. You didn't even let me eat anything. You literally starved me. Clara, is this true? Come on, Damola. Why would I possibly starve a little child? She's just doing all this just to get you to hate me. That's not true. Maybe, girl, it's okay. 
Come, let's let's get your lunch, okay? Okay. And you need to take off that dress. It's not yours. <laughs> yes. Let's go. Let's go. What are you doing here? You're not supposed to pick up until tomorrow. The mother is my girl. Mommy! Hey baby, how are you doing? Wait, what's this on your ear? Oh, it's Auntie Clara. She pulled my ear. The mother, what's she talking about? What's she talking about? Look, it's, it's, it's nothing. I've handled it. Handled what? That left my daughter under your care, and I'm coming back to meet her like this. She called me earlier that she not had something to eat. Why you to tell me that you left my daughter in the hands of a total stranger? That's her. How dare you lay your kitty hands on my daughter? Hey, How hey, dare hey, you? Hey, 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 How dare you? Hey, hey, Let her go! How dare you? Calm down. I didn't do anything. I only disciplined your child for being so disrespectful. Something the both of you failed to do. Wait! Just... Wait! Is she trying to call me a failed mother? Like, that didn't raise my daughter very well. Just come. Daddy, no, I no. Have, Mom, I've got that for you. You have the gun. Get your filthy hands off me, you little brat. It's okay. It's okay. Let go of me. Sweetie, let's leave this place. Don't worry, baby. I'll come and see you, okay? Come on, you're not seeing her anytime soon. What's that supposed to mean? Why would you say that? You're not even supposed to pick up today. It's supposed to be tomorrow. You need to pack your things and leave my house this minute. Is there a problem? I'm supposed to be spending the weekend, remember? Well, unfortunately, my daughter does not like you. You terrify her. How could you put your hands on her? At least by now, you should know that children are bound to misbehave, right? I see. So instead of scolding your daughter for being such a sport brat, you're angry at me. <laughs> Is this how you want to raise her? Making up excuses for her misconduct? You need to pack your things and leave my house and I'll not repeat myself. A lady who cannot love my child does not deserve to be with me. I'm so sorry, baby. Like, how can I be alive and a woman did this to you? Look at Max everywhere. I'm so sorry, baby. Look, Clara, she's very wicked. But she's not the only one. You mean there are more? Yes. There's Tabitha and Nancy. They're very lazy and dirty. They don't even know how to cook. They're wow. always ordering from outside. So what do you and Dad eat? We cook by ourselves. I help Dad clean the house and I also help her with the laundry. I'm so sorry, baby. I'm so sorry that you have to go through this at such a young age. I feel so bad. No, please don't cry. Mama will do anything for you and dad to come back together. Baby, you know that's never going to happen, right? Your dad and I live in two separate worlds right now. We're not compatible. That was why we divorced. But you love dad and I know dad loves you too. Baby. Some things are just deeper than you think. Don't worry, everything will be fine, okay? Okay. Everything will be fine. You're a strong girl.
I'm sorry, I just uh, came to drop off. You should have waited till tomorrow. So you care for juice, wine, or what? Um, I'm actually okay. Thank you. Look, I just wanted to say I'm sorry what happened with Clara. I had an impromptu meeting and when I left, I thought she was going to look after her. But I didn't know she was going to hurt her. Can you hear yourself? You know you don't know her well enough and you left my daughter under her care. That tells the kind of father you are, Damola. Look, it was only a mistake. And I promise that it won't happen again. See, I love Luli as much as you do. Okay? She's my world as well. And I'll do anything to protect her. Listen, can't you just settle for just one girl? All this Sophia today, Becky tomorrow, Joy the next day. I don't want stuff like that around my daughter. You're exposing her too much. Okay, okay, fine. Fine, I've heard. Okay? She's in her room. She's been asking of you, though. Doris, baby, the traveler. Ah, ah. Look at my girl now, you Chloe. Thank you. How have you been, Jerry? I'm fine. You can have yours. Thank you, my darling. Jesus Christ. Doris, what happened to you? I'm fine. You are fine? I am. Um, I had a little domestic accident. I'm okay. Like, you call this little. I am Come okay. on now, look at your hands. You know how this helps behave. Apparently, she didn't clean the staircase dry enough, so I slipped. I'm fine. So you need any medication or treatment? Something like that? Cynthia, darling, I am okay. Mm, trust me, it doesn't even hurt much. Okay. So, yeah. so just me. How have you been? Nothing serious, Jerry. I'm just here. Mm. Nothing much. You owe me one. <laughs> You're not giving me about this, your Kenya trip, your last trip with your hobby. Oh my god. Full details, please. It was incredible. I mean, on field. Oh. Ah, James outdid himself this time. Don't he me. surprised me. We even went shopping. Uh uh. Guess how much I'm wearing? How would you know? <laughs> $5,000. Eh? Mm hmm. You have closed my boutique. <laughs> I know. <laughs> You're really enjoying this, your marriage, Joe. Oh, like, you're one of the few that got it right. You can say that again. God bless your marriage. Amen. Sometimes, Sha, I miss being married. But what can I do? Don't worry, my dear. Very soon, the man who is more deserving of you will find you. You think I so? I don't want you to worry yourself over that Damola guy. Don't ever regret leaving him. You did the right thing. A man who is more deserving of you, he will come very soon. Don't worry. Mm. I hope so. I know so. Look at you now. Eh? You're a very pretty lady. <laughs> Have you seen that? Pulling my leg, babe, I beg. <laughs> Look, all you need to do is hang out more often. Leave this your busy, busy every time. Uh -uh. And hang out. <laughs> Men will die. Uh -uh. You know you now. Men would die just to have you. Mm? So go out more and right. show them. <laughs> um, I've not seen my goddaughter around. Where is she? So they had that. Oh, okay. A dog wife. Look at you now. One and only. Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> so, how's business? Mm -mm, no, I don't like her. She's not even pretty. You have rejected every single woman in that selection. Isn't there any lady you like? No, because they're not pretty. But it's not about the pretty face. It's about what's in here. Well, how do you even meet all of these friends? Well, technically, they're not my friends. I met them on a dating app. What's a dating app? Ah, here we go. <laughs> OK, a dating app is somewhere adults meet, right? They have uh, similar interests, exchange their bios, their professional backgrounds, and if they like themselves, they book a date and they go on it. 
Okay, so when are you going? I haven't selected a woman yet. There's no one you like. <laughs> well, because they're not pretty. <laughs> okay, you know what? There's someone I think you like. Who is that? Don't worry, you'll see. Rita, and your dad has told me so much about you. Hey. Hey, baby. How are you? Oh, it's been ages since I last saw you. I'm so happy you invited me. And I've met your daughter, Luna. Lulu, you got it right the first time. Oh, right. Lulu, she's so adorable. Mm -hmm. she yeah, is. she is. Hmm. Who is she? Um, she is my old friend from uni. <laughs> yeah, your dad and I were such an item, you know, until he <laughs> vanished after youth service and reconnected only two years ago. And that was when he told me a little story of how he met and married your mom and then they separated. Rita! Rita! Sorry, sorry. Please, uh, come I'm just me. excited to be in this beautiful city with you two beautiful people. Yeah. <laughs> Please. Mm, thank you. You don't like me very much. <laughs> she does. She adores you. Welcome to my room. Wow. You have a really, really lovely home here. I do? Yes. I like it. <sighs> thank you. Mm-hmm. All right, let me go get your things from the car, okay? Oh, no, 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 not so fast. I mean, you haven't even given me a proper welcome yet, you know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Babes, please, chill. What? <laughs> you haven't seen me in ages. Don't you miss me? That's not the case. I just think we should take things slow, okay? Let things flow naturally. What do you mean? Damola, I was your girlfriend. What do you mean, take things slow and get to know each other again? But that was back in uni. Things have changed, okay? And besides, you're going to be here for one week. So what's the rush? Hmm? Let me go get your things. Okay. It's a wonderful meal. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Luna, you haven't touched your food. Are you alright? Luli. Oh, sorry, honey. You know, both names sound alike, but I kind of like Luna better. Hmm? <laughs> Guys, please. We're eating here. Table manners. Okay, Can we okay. talk less? Yeah. Okay, here. Let me feed you. Not a child. I'm sorry. I'll go talk to her. I don't think your daughter likes me very much. Don't worry, she does. <laughs> Luli, what was that? What was that attitude in there for? She was only trying to be nice to you. The least she could have done is to be nice back to her. I don't like her. <sighs> Louis, come. The issue is you don't like anybody. How can you like someone when you don't even try to get to know them? Give her a chance, okay? You never knew you could like her. No. Louis, remember we have an agreement. Same. So are you going to apologize? It's not me you should be apologizing to. You should be apologizing to her. Okay? 
Okay. Alright. But I'm telling you that I still won't like her. I'm telling you that I still don't like her. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Do you like what you see? Absolutely, baby. <laughs> Sweetie, why are you not sleeping? Come, come, what's wrong? My classmate Jack, he told me a scary story about monsters who eat children. Really? Oh, it's okay. Alright, you can sleep here for tonight, alright? Come on! Yeah! Don't be scared of monsters, okay? Okay? And look, monsters are just a fairy tale. They're not real. I know they tell stories and they write storybooks about them, but they're not real. What about spirits? Spirits? That's a whole new <laughs> ball game. But I'll talk about that later. Are you going to join us? You should sleep, okay? Oh, if you don't want to join us, I have more space. Don't be like that. Yeah. It's okay. It's time to go to bed, okay? Don't. My friend, mm. all these are new designs, like oh. new designs. Okay. I specifically selected just this few for you. For you, for my old wife. They are all so beautiful. Before that, customers get hold of them. Look at this one. But are you sure? I'm the only one with the same exact design. Uh-uh. You know how much I hate it when I dress up and I see other people outside with the same things I'm wearing. You don't trust me again. My clothes are luxurious and very unique. You can't see them elsewhere. Luxury or nothing. I trust you. Of course. So, how much are they? 150k each. Then the three you selected. This one. Are you taking this one? Yeah, they're pretty. Okay, this one and okay. this blue one. Okay. So, how much are they? Okay, they are just 150k each. So, the three you selected this one, this one, and this one. That's just 450,000. Okay. I'll pay you by the end of the month. So, uh, uh, don't read now. You know, you've not paid me for the last shopping now. Your son is still 1 million. That will make it 1.4 something. Mm. You know what? I'll pay you 1.5 million naira. So you can use the remaining 50k to shop for my goddaughter. Money is not a problem now. Don't worry. Don't worry now. Money is not a problem now. Just pay it once now. It's not like the money is not there. Uh -uh. You're not a good wife now. I'll Abba. pay you by the end of the month. You know, James gives me 5 million naira every month for upkeep. I know. <laughs> It's just that I've used the one he gave me for this one, so I'm building for my parents. You don't mean it. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. I'm proud of you. That's nice. Thank you. I'm doing it myself because I don't want him to know about it. So that when he's ready, he can build another one for them. You are so lucky. You know, he sent my younger brother Kenny to the US for his master's. Is that so? He's doing a lot. Mm. You're so lucky. You're so lucky to even have a good man. I know. Ah, this color is so beautiful. And it will suit your skin. Yes. Look at this cap. It will suit your skin so well. Ah, it's fine. Look at that. It will go with your skin. Mm -hmm. so I know. I'll just give it. I know. Which <laughs> answers by my friend. Friends of patronizing is my small, so <laughs> small business. You call this small business. Do you know how much I'm carrying here like this? <laughs> Damala. Today. Hello, Damala. Mm, mom, it's me, Luli. Luli. 
Is it that way you have his phone? No, I'm in the bathroom. So what's going on? Well, there's this auntie in the house. And she tried to feed me. Big girl like me. I'm gonna refuse. Daddy forced me to apologize. Lily, please, please, please. I'm having a very busy day. Is that all you have to say? But mom, this is important. Can't you see that dad is trying to marry another woman? Okay, I, I guess I'll start going now. I'll call you back, okay, baby? Talk to you later. Bye. Hmm. What do I do now? It's my daughter. Eh? What did she say? Jama Queen. <laughs> what did she say? She just called me. She's been trying her best to get her dad and I back together. I can't believe she just called me now to tell me that her dad is with someone. A lady, obviously. Eh? That's what she called. The Mola brings girls to the house. Mm hmm And what's wrong with that? Everything is wrong with it, Cynthia. Uh-uh. That girl is too young to be exposed to that kind of lifestyle now. See? I would advise you fight for full custody of the child. Ha. <laughs> there is. Are you kidding me? I should separate <laughs> Demola from his child. Do you know how close those two are? Cynthia, I pity you. Honestly, I do. You are so gullible that you still allow this guy to walk all over you, even after divorcing you. Uh-uh, ah. no. You know that's the other way around. I divorced him. Not him. Wow. What is the difference? Look, the difference. All I'm saying is, you shouldn't allow this guy lord over you through your daughter. It's been five years since you divorced and you're still single. All because he's always in your face. That's not correct. <sighs> That's not correct. You know, I've really tried to date. Just that uh, it didn't just end well. And right now, I've decided to take my time. Because I don't want to make the same mistake twice. Still. I will take my time till I get the right person, Doris. Still, take her away from his madness. Eh? She's too young to be in a space where women are being changed like clothes. It's not good for her now. Please, oh, I don't like it. You have to do the right thing. See? You need to leave, oh. You better do the right thing. I'll see you tomorrow. Good day, hey, hey, baby, how are you? Okay, this, this. Okay, so tell me, which one should I wear between these two? This and this. I need to look so fabulous today because your dad is taking me out on a date. A date? What's a date? Well, a date is when two adults who are in love go to a fancy and glamorous place to hang out. And your dad has booked the best restaurant. Can I come? No, you can't. You can't. Dates are for adults, not for children. Okay? Yes. So, give me this. Ah. Um, by the way, you should wear the red one. My dad loves red. You should totally keep the red one. Really? Why did Damo last time like him red? Well, I guess his taste has changed. So, I'll wear this one. I'm so excited. Um, and by the way, you might have to fix your makeup. It's looking a bit too rough. Really? I can't see anything. It looks perfect to me. But it's fine. I'll just retouch it when I finish dressing up. Okay? <laughs> Don't.
Hey, you're back so early. Shouldn't you be at work? Guys, welcome! Excuse me, I can't breathe. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. Then why are you tearing up? Um, nothing really. I'm, I'm just a bit emotional, that's all. Why are you emotional? Well, it's just some um, things I had to do today. And you should know that men don't cry. I don't believe that. Look, sweetie, you know that I love you, right? And I'll do anything for you. I love you too. What's wrong with Cynthia? She just doesn't want my happiness. Every time I try to pick up my shattered pieces, she comes in and she breaks me even further. <clears throat> Oh, I don't, I don't, I don't know Cynthia to be like that. I, I thought you guys had a perfect, you know, this perfect marriage thing, you know, these positive vibes and all, and fact, beautiful marriage. But at the end of the day, what went wrong? Marriage, maybe say I was always, you know, being jealous of, like, I want to save myself. Come on, serious. You're a lawyer. Please advise me. In this case, what are the chances that I have? Because I am not going to, I'm not going to lose my daughter without a fight. Well, to start with, you're not fighting anybody. She's a wife. And your wife shall remain. But there are, you know, a couple of things to consider when you're a cop before, you know, giving a child custody. Number one, you consider the, the age of the child. Consider the wishes of that child. You consider the willingness of the child to even stay with either of the parents. You consider work schedule. And I know you, Damola, I know you very well. You're a very busy person. You know, and the most important of all is um, you consider your availability to be able to take care of that child. It does this your numerous, will you be able to take care of that child? And if Cynthia, as intelligent as that girl is, if Cynthia, her adventure, proves to the court that you're unable to take care of that child, or you will be unable to take care of that child, you'll lose that child. Simple advice. She wouldn't dare do that to me. Hmm. We both agreed to share custody. And she didn't care about my daughter. So why now? What suddenly changed? Well, have you checked yourself? Yamala, have you checked yourself? You need to cut down the numerous girls that come to your house. Cut it down. You have a girl child. She's looking up to you. And she's growing so fast. You're no longer a child. Look, I'm doing my best. You have a great day. 
<sighs> the only person that is here is Rita. She's staying for a week. I'm honestly doing my best. Bro, I've been single for too long. Yeah, true, 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 ah. true. I'm not going to be single forever. Emil. Hey, Lily. Food is served. Come, let's eat. You can finish up your homework later. Let's eat, okay? So the food doesn't get cold. Let's see what she made. You're welcome. Who made you? Really? Who else? You? No, not me. The auntie you took it. What is this? Rita! Rita! Yes? Okay. Why is there cockroach in our food? Oh my god. That's a cockroach. Exactly, but what is it doing in my food? I, 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 I don't know. It wasn't there when I served it. Let me, just, let me just have you. Let me just have you. Don't bother. Lily, come, we're eating us. No, I, it's okay. I really don't know how we got there. <laughs> No, I have to work. How am I going to make all this possible? <laughs> uh. I can't. I can't. <laughs> Luli! Luli! Are you alright? Luli, you okay? You okay? You okay? What happened? Did you hit your head? Wet. Yeah, it's not. Sorry, sweetie, okay? Sorry. Are you feeling anything? Sorry, sorry. Hey, I had to go see you. Uh, Are you sure you're okay? Because I don't mind taking you to no, the hospital. No, 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 no. No, I'm okay. I'm okay. I don't even like the smell of hospitals anyways. And my body is even pinning me anymore. Are you sure? Yes. Okay, so you can go and sleep in your bedroom. No, please let me sleep in your room, please. Okay, I'm that's angry fine. at you. No, 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 please. I want that pin <laughs> oh. I want my mommy. <laughs> It's okay. It's okay. Babes, is this where you slept? too invested with your daughter and I do want to get to you. Look. That bed is big enough. And even if you didn't want to sleep in the bedroom, there are other bedrooms in the house. Why here? 
Tamola, I came here to spend time with you. But you haven't even had the time to be with me. Look, I'm sorry about that, but she was just upset. Was she? Was she upset? So are you going back to the bedroom? I'm sorry that I've neglected you. Okay? I shouldn't have neglected you. You're, you're my guest. I should do better. Damola, I'm not asking for too much, am I? Just a little bit of your time. Okay, okay. Why don't we go on a date tonight? Hmm? I mean, I know the last one didn't work out. But we can go on one tonight. Please, please. Rita, come on. I said I'm sorry. Sorry. Sweetie, you know what? I'll I'll come and meet you downstairs, okay? <laughs> It's okay, it's okay. You should just go, just go, just go. Let me take it downstairs. Yeah, yeah. Alright, come, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. It'll be time. We'll be back before you know it. But why do adults love going on dates? The only thing they do on dates is eat and talk. Can't you do that at home? Yes, but the last time you told me that you enjoyed yourself. I lied. I hated it. I was dying of boredom. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll get you your ice cream on our way home, okay? Does that work for you? No. Don't, don't worry yourself. I don't like ice cream. Ice cream has too much sugar content. And past my mom says it's not good for you. Well, can I have some a glass of water instead? I couldn't reach it from the fridge. Oh, okay. I'll get it for you. What is this? Mommy, it's me, mommy, and you. <laughs> But my head is not that big. How come you made it so big? And your mom's legs are not that small. Yeah. <laughs> but it's a nice picture, though. I like it. I'm, I'm so, I, I, to I see. Here I you see. go, darling. That's a really nice picture. Thank you. <laughs> you ruined my dress! Oh my I'm god! So, it's okay. It's okay. Really? I'm, so, I'm so sorry. I guess you can't go on your date again. It's okay. Sweetie, I'm sorry. It's okay. Um, no, the date is not ruined. It's not ruined. It's fine. Just go upstairs and change to something else. Wait, you're still going? Yes. Things are broken. <gasps> I'm sorry. I'm oh, sorry. Why didn't you hold the glass? It was a mistake. Just don't move. Pull this place up. You need to be more careful, okay? Look, 
Rita, please, I'm, I'm sorry for what happened downstairs. Can you change it to something else and then we can go on our dates? Damola, your daughter does not like me. She don't want me to be with you. Can't you see? Why would you say a thing like that? She actually likes you. Look, take. Mom, Dad and I. She doesn't want me with you. She went as far as even putting pepper in my powder. Oh, come on, Rita, stop it. Man. She's, not, she's not capable of doing something like Here. that. You can sniff it yourself. Are you sure this is not a mistake? I've been using this powder for so long. It's not a mistake. She did it. I just didn't tell you because I didn't want you to scold her. But this has gotten too far. Damola, you have to let your daughter know that what she's doing is very wrong. It's not right. It's not. My friend, don't get choked though. Where are you coming from looking this way and why are you so hungry? James is traveling to Paris for a business meeting. Again? I have been packing the whole day. I'm just coming back from the market where I went to buy some of the things he's traveling with. Okay. I've been so busy that I even forgot to take care of myself or eat. I was around the estate to pick up some things from his friend when hunger hit me. I decided to branch your place, please. Oh, I've missed your food. So you mean you're not traveling with him this time? Mm -mm. No. The kids are coming back from school for their meet and break. Oh, it's true. And you know now, someone has to be in the house with them. Mm. How far? You just me. Have you discussed with them all about the cost of the thing? Yes, so I told him already. I know it will be very difficult for him and I feel for him in a way. Mm. <laughs> I know it has not been easy with him. But what can I do? Then you should do the right thing. And create an enabling environment for that child. See? Don't let him deceive you with his crocodile tears. Me, I've said my own name. This is your food. Do you have more? Finish this one you're eating first. Look, I don't spill yourself. Or look, I rise on your body. I feel like I'm going to faint. There's more. I okay. can get more for you. But first finish this one. Don't spill the food on your cell phone. Does it matter? Mm. I need more water. Thank okay. you. Come here. I knew I would find you here. Went to your girlfriend's house to gossip, right? You think you can run away from me? James, it's not like that. Doris, where's my money? Where is my money? James, we're outside. All right now, we're move outside. it, move it, move it. Nice. Move or else I'll crack your head now. I'll use something to crack your head. I'll peel your skin pieces by pieces. Right, So fake. <laughs> <laughs> 
Dad, I was watching that. Oh, wait. You didn't go on a date? Obviously. Isn't that what you wanted? No. No, no, no. I wouldn't. No, I didn't do anything. I didn't do it. I haven't asked you if you did anything. Yet you said you didn't do anything. So what exactly did you do? Fine, I didn't. But only because I didn't like her. What's the meaning of that? You know you could have hurt her in the process, right? Yes, and she did not get hurt. So what's the problem? Why are you shouting? It doesn't mean that what you did was right. Now go upstairs and apologize to her. No, thank you. I am not going to repeat myself a second time. Fine. You can have that back. It's really spicy on my hands. Thank you. I still don't like her. She's gotten into her. Upstairs. What do you want? My dad said I should come and apologize to you about whatever I told him. So just tell him that I did that. Hey, hey, hey. come here. Little witch, not so fast. <laughs> I can see that you don't want me to be with your dad, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, so you're smart now. I greet you specially. <laughs> come, 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 come here. Listen to me. Let me tell you. Mm -hmm. hmm? I like your dad very much. Mm -hmm. I've always liked your dad. Mm -hmm. Even before your mom. And I know he likes me too. Okay? I'm not going to allow you, little witch, ruin things between me and your dad. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. So you better apologize to me now before <laughs> I tell him. That you didn't. He will never believe you, and this is your life story of yours. <laughs> what? Hmm. Okay, no problem. Try me. I will try you, my dear. Mm -hmm. Look at this girl, Lou. This girl. Little witch. I'll deal with you. It's a good thing you're here. I wanted to let you know that I'm going to be picking up Lolo tomorrow. My girl is just arrived and I'll be traveling to Abuja. Top you don't mind though. I honestly don't mind, that's fine. But I came here to talk. See, Damola, if you're here because of a child's custody, please, 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 my mind is made up. I'm not interested. I'm not changing my mind. Look, I'm not here to fight a lawsuit with you. That's not why I'm here. Then give her to me and get out of our lives. It's very simple. How do you expect me to do that when you guys are practically family to me? Damala, we are not family. We stop being family the moment you choose to walk away. We are not. Please, don't say that. The last time I checked, Cynthia, you said you wanted space, and I gave it to you. Mm -hmm. Only for me to come back and then you welcome me with divorce papers. So stop acting like as if you're the saint here. You caused this. That's the problem here. You always give up without fighting. But I'll be fair this time. You can come visit her once in a while. That is if it's okay by you. Are you telling me that I will not have custody over my child? Oh, it's very simple. Because that's not going to happen. Alright? You're not going to put me in a situation where I will not have custody over my child. And if that's the case, then I will fight you. So you can have time for your numerous women. My child is not safe, Damala. Okay then. You would hear from me. Have a good day. Luli, how old are you? 
Nine. Put that down. I'm talking to you. I'm listening with my ears, not my hand or my eyes. Are you insane? Are, are you insane? Pay attention when I'm talking to you. Ah. What's wrong with this? Please give that back. Can you, can you see how, how messy the house is? There are piles of dirty plates in the sink and all you've been doing all morning is, is, is play, playing some stupid game. Go and do those dishes now. No, I won't. I'm just a child. At nine, you're just a child. At six, I've already started finding chores. Liar. What? What did you say to me? I said I'm not going to do anything. Okay. You're not going to do it, right? Fine. Then you won't be eating any food in this house today. Oh, <laughs> yes, I will be eating something. Because this is my father's house. You're just a stranger. You don't even pay the rent. <laughs> okay. Well, I'll be marrying your father. And you know what that means? It means I'm in charge of this house. And you will do exactly as I say. God forbid. My father will never marry. What? Luli! Okay. We shall see. Go and wash those plates now. Move it! Wash those plates. Start washing those plates now! No, 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 no. Is that how to wash plates? Is that how to wash plates? I need to and wash it properly. Father will not marry you. We shall see. Wash it! If it's, if, it's, if it's to run your mouth like a parrot and eat, you will know how to do that one better. But I thought you were marrying my father. Why don't you come and do it now? Are you talking back at me? Huh? Eh? I should come and do it. I should come and do it. But you said you're marrying Shut up and wash those plates. I've not even started. When I'm done with you, eh? Okay. I'm You're tired. You're tired. I've not even started. Wash those plates. There are still more chores waiting for you. Playing game by this time of the Luli, are you still washing these clothes? Mm -hmm. If you allow me to beat you and this girl, wash these clothes first. Don't, don't, don't allow me to forget this cane on, you, on your body now. I'll report you to my daddy. If you don't shut up, you report me to your daddy. Mm -hmm. your daddy. Oh. Wash those clothes now, come inside. But I'm tired. Oh, what's this on your body? What's this mask? Don't tell me this is another domestic accident. Is this something you're not telling me about? Cynthia, I'm fine. Oh, your body. You know how clumsy I can be sometimes. I'm okay. Ah, it's nothing serious. This really. is very serious, so. Look at your body. Are you sure you are? Wait, wait, wait. Don't tell me this is another domestic accident. Is this something you're not telling me? Look at your hands. What's this? Cynthia, are I'm you fine? fine? You know how clumsy I can be sometimes. I'm okay. This is serious. Look, this is very serious. This is not why I'm here. Um, actually, I came so you can lend me some money. You know, James traveled to Paris and he didn't leave any money with me. He believed the five million era he gives me monthly, I still have some things left. So, you know, the building projects for my parents okay. yeah so the kids are around and i don't have anything in the house so how much are we looking at um like a 200k doris two hundred thousand there but you know i'm traveling to abuja for my goods and i don't have much on me so how much can you spare okay i can actually get 70,000 naira for you now, but I'll go into the kitchen and also add foodstuffs for you and the kids. I hope you understand. All right, I'll manage. Okay, then I'm coming. Okay. Hey. <sighs> I'm tired. Stop 
sleeping on that thing. Will you do it fast? Do it fast. Do it fast. Look at those corners there. Just mop all that area. Can you have one? Do that thing fast. Um, Hurry up, you're um, sleeping on this thing. Do it fast! Ha! Ah. Um, it's too heavy. Lulu, sweetie. Where did you go? What are you doing sleeping in the parlor? <laughs> I want my mommy. Wait, come. I don't want to be here anymore. I want to go back to mommy. Are you okay? Why are you running in temperature? What happened? Auntie, she made me clean the dishes and wash her clothes. So I'm not, my, not my whole body is pinning me. She did what? I, I just want my mommy. Please, try, take me to mommy, please. I'll be right back. Oh, Rita. Yeah, home. Why did you subject my daughter to an abuse? What? Abuse? <laughs> what, what are you talking about? You know exactly what I'm talking about. She's downstairs there laying on the couch and telling me that you, you asked her to do chores. <laughs> I didn't do anything. Why would I ask a little girl to, to, to clean the house? I did all these chores myself. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I know what this is all about. Your daughter doesn't like me. She's doing everything possible for you to throw me out. You know I cannot hurt a child. You know. Look, Rita, I don't know you. I stopped knowing you a long time ago. And I barely even know who you are. I can't even just believe that you think I would, I would hurt your child. I can't do that. Uh -uh. I love your daughter very much. I just hope that one day she will get to accept me. Uh, I didn't do anything, no. I didn't do anything. What is this? It's 50,000 naira. That is all I could get from my friend. Please. Next week I will look for the rest and complete it. So please let me come inside. So, out of the 200,000 naira you stole from me, you're giving me this rubbish. Doris! What did you do with my money? I said, what did you do with my money? Please, my husband. Can we not do this outside? Mm. Just let me in, please. I beg you. Okay. Please. Please, my husband. Please. Look. Look here. You will not be allowed into this house until you complete my money. And you must complete it today. Now go. Go in touch with my money. I said go. You want me to go physical? Huh? Give me my money today or else. It's okay. Hope it doesn't taste too bitter. Uh -huh. You want to rest? <sighs> Do you want me to call your mom? Mm. I mean, it's late, but if you want me to, I can call her. Mm, it's okay. Can we talk to her tomorrow? Yes, mommy's supposed to pick you up tomorrow. But unfortunately, she's traveling and she won't be back until the weekend. So I was thinking, since I'm not doing anything tomorrow, maybe I can take you out and we can do something fun. How does that sound? Okay, but 
Can I go to bed now? Are you feeling sleepy? Maybe the drugs are making you drowsy. Okay. You can go to bed now. But hey, let me say something. I know you don't like Aunt Sarita very much. And I still think you should give her some time. Maybe you might like her. But that doesn't mean that you should make things up about her. It's not nice. But I didn't make anything up about her. Why don't you ever believe me? I do believe you, but I'm just saying it's not nice. All right, tell you what. If at the end of the week, you don't like Auntie Rita, when she leaves, I'll make sure that she doesn't come back again. Okay? Okay. All right, sweetie. Good night. There was a robbery in my estate. Sit down. So where are the kids now? I was able to sneak out with the kids. Ah. I took them to their aunt's house. Oh my god. But you know how I am with that woman. I couldn't Please stay there with properly. her. So... Oh. Hi. Yeah, wait. Let me get you water. I'm coming back, okay? Okay. But I told you guys, this is security. What happened? So let me see. Those ones are so incompetent. I don't even know how those guys got into the estate. Oh, wow. Despite how tight your estate is. So let's not even talk about those, those security people. It was the gunshot and people screaming, dogs barking, that woke me up. Uh -uh. Thank God I was able to escape with the kids. I don't even know how I did it. I'm Thank just God grateful you are fine now. Thank My God. Sister. Ah, don't worry, you are, you are free. So do you prefer anything? You want me to get you anything to no, eat? No, no, I just I just need to sleep. Don't worry, I'll come. Let's go inside. I'll go sleep, okay? Ah, wow, what is this country turning into? This is the way to be security, eh? Luli, you haven't touched your food. Because I'm not hungry. But you haven't eaten anything today, have you? Hmm? Are you still upset from yesterday? Look, if you want to talk to your mom, I can call her for you. What's wrong with her? I guess she's so angry from what happened earlier on. Damola, believe me, I really didn't do anything to her. But, but don't worry, I'm going to talk to her and make sure she's okay. Hmm? Okay, thanks. Well, I'll have to go get her things from my mom's place later. She's staying this weekend? Yes, her mom is busy. And here I was thinking I was going to get some alone time with you before I leave. I guess that's not going to happen. Maybe when next I visit. Look, I'm sorry, okay? None of this was planned. And thanks for understanding. Mm, it's okay. Good morning. Oh, good morning. You're leaving already. Oh yeah, I have no a breakfast. flight to catch. Oh. But I'll be coming back first thing tomorrow morning. In case you need anything, make sure you call me. Mm -hmm. Okay? Thank you. Have a safe flight. Yes, and, and that reminds me. 
Kamala will be coming today to pick up Loli's bag. He's watching about Loli because I won't be around. Are you sure you really want the custody of this child? Of course, I have asked my lawyer to serve him already. <laughs> and yet you're giving this guy so much evidence to use against you in court. Sorry, so I don't get you now. Cynthia, why do you like acting so ignorant? Doris, I don't understand. You're giving this guy so much evidence to use against you in court. How do you mean? He can just tell them that you're not always available to take care of the child and that he's the only one taking care of the child every weekend because why? You always travel on your business trips. And guess what? You will lose to him. <laughs> just think about it. Okay, you know, just take care of the house. Okay. Yeah, I've said my own. Take care. Hi, Pamela. How you doing? I'm alright. How are you? Well, long time no see. Yeah. How have you been now? Been okay. I mean, it's been years? Three years. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, anyway, I came to get Lulie's things. Oh, right. She told me about it. Let me just go get them for you. Alright, thank you. Yeah. Thanks. Um, Damola, please, there's something I'd like to discuss with you. It's about Cynthia. Cynthia? Is everything okay? Uh, look, Damola, you're a good man. And what Cynthia is doing to you is not fair at all. I hate the situation she's putting you into. She told me she filed for full custody of Luli. Trust me. I tried to advise her, but you know how stubborn Cynthia can be. And that is because she wants to relocate abroad with Luli. That's why she's doing all that. What? Please, don't tell anybody I told you. You know she's my friend, and I'm not supposed to tell you this. But ha, I can't sit down and watch you suffer like this. I know how much you love your daughter, and I don't want you to be separated from her. That is what I'm telling you. Please. Hmm? And Cynthia told you this? <laughs> there is this man from the U.S. that she wants to get married to. So he wants to relocate them abroad. You mean to tell me Cynthia is getting married? <laughs> She's so in love with this man. He's all she talks about every time. Uh, well, I hope you guys are able to sort out whatever is going on between you. Um, yeah, thank you, okay? You're welcome. Please take it easy. Bye. is very fresh. I just want to say I'm sorry if I did anything that hurt you. I don't want. Please have it. Leave me. I said I don't want. You know you're being very rude right now and that's not a good thing. She deliberately spilled the juice on me because I was trying to, to get her to be in a good mood. She spilled it on herself. Luli, what has gotten over you? Why would you do that to her? 
You need to apologize to her this minute. No, it's okay. It's fine, Damola. Don't worry. No, what she did was wrong. She needs to apologize to you what? this minute. She spilled it on herself. Stand up from there and, and apologize to her. I didn't do anything. Get on your knees and apologize to her properly. See, see, see. She's even spreading the whole thing on me. Now say you're sorry. Apologize to her this minute. What's going on here, Damola? She did something wrong and I was only scolding her. By asking her to kneel down? For her? Your daughter spilled a glass of juice on me! Oh, Shut up! It. Shut your mouth! This is between my ex-husband and I. You have no say here, young lady. Damola, you disappoint me. Loli, let's go. And where do you think you're taking my daughter to? And what's that supposed to mean? I know of your plans to take my daughter and relocate, but that's not going to happen. You can say anything you want to say. Look, I want you to know that I will fight you if you try to do that to me. Please don't fight me. Because you will not separate me from my daughter. You will not, and I will not allow it. Who is going to clean all this mess? <laughs> Tamola. Oh, Lily, go freshen up. So, that, why did you come back? Hmm. My dear, I cancelled my trip to pick up Lily, and I'm glad I did. Because what I saw Damala doing to my child, she's so young and she shouldn't be going through such trauma. Calm down. What really happened? Hmm. You can't believe Damala asked my girl to kneel and apologize to his girlfriend. For what? Just for spilling a glass of juice on her. Damola, I have always known that that guy is a good for nothing guy. And I knew that these kind of things would keep happening if you don't take that child away from him. See, I'm still wondering, like, how can a father, how can a father do this to his only child? It's okay. By the time he's denied access from seeing her, he will come back to his senses. Men. Every day, I kneel down to thank God for the kind of man I married. James can never do that to his children. I and the kids are his topmost priority. I'm so grateful. You see, Damola, I promise to deal with him. I promise to fight Damola. You have to. I won't let you. You can't treat go. your child like that. I won't. Ha. Zizou, I just knew that that guy. I've been warning you now. I've been warning you. Damola. Okay. If she wants to take the girl abroad, how is that a problem to you? She's going to get better education there than here. Damola, you need to concentrate on your life. You are way too invested in taking care of your daughter that you don't see anything else. She's my daughter. And I cannot be separated from her. I will not let that happen. I will not allow that. This is more than just your daughter. It's also about her mom, right? You're still in love with her mother. Are you listening to yourself talk? It seems to me like you're not just only scared of losing your daughter, you're also scared of losing the mother too, right? Look, I don't know what this nonsense is about because I do not care about Cynthia. Hmm. But you see, my daughter, I will fight for her with everything that I own. Do you understand me? And while we're on this topic, I want you to go upstairs Pack your things and leave my house this minute. What? You heard me.
open the door for that. No. Because henceforth you won't be seeing him anymore. But I want to see him. No. And that's final. But he didn't do anything wrong. Luli, now go to your room. No. I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to go with my dad. And I'm not going to travel abroad with you. I said go to your room now. I know you can hear me. Can you open the door? No, open the door. Can you please open the door? I know you can hear me. Can you stop barking like a madman and go home? Me, madman. Look, open the door. I just want to talk. Just leave, okay? We have nothing to talk about. Why are you being unreasonable? I said open the door, let's talk. You are crazy. And if you don't leave here this minute, I'll call the security on you. I promise you. Get out! Look, there's no need for anything. Please, just open the door. I said get out! Please, I just want to talk. It's not too much to ask. I said leave! Somebody be a single mom in peace. Hello, Dad. Hey, sweetie, how are you? I'm fine. Mom said that I'm not going to be seeing you anymore. Is that true? No, sweetie, come on, that's not true. You know that's not true. I'll do anything to make sure that we'll be together again, okay? Just do this for me. Be a good girl, all right? And I'll make sure that I see you soon. I miss you, I miss you sweetie. I miss you too. All right, bye. Luli, who are you talking to? Give me that phone now. I said give me the phone. But why are you guys always fighting? He never did anything. You were talking why? to your dad. Why? Why don't you listen to simple instruction? Wait, wait, wait. You, 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 you don't mean it. So, who told you that she's eloping abroad with um, Luli? This is, this is serious. So, whoa, 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 wait, Damala. Why would, why would our friend tell you this? Well, he said I'm good and I deserve to know. The point is, she's denying me access to her. She's not picking my calls and she isn't allowing me into her house. I want to be a part of my daughter's life. She wants to take that away from me and I won't let it happen. See, see, Damala, there is something, there is something that is not adding up. I don't know Cynthia to be like this. How can Cynthia just wake up from the blues and all of a sudden she wants to have full custody of this child? Uh, wait, wait. Hope, hope is <laughs> Damula. Hope is not what I'm thinking. Hope you've done done something else again, aside the complete evidence that she gave in court that you 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 uh, numerous ladies comes to your house and all that, and that is the reason why she's not trusting Luli being in, in your custody. Hope you've not done something else. Yeah, Damala, I feel for you. I know you still love me, don't you? Yeah, well, um, sometimes. You don't hate her, Damala. I'm not capable of hating Cynthia. She's a good woman. Without her, I won't have Luli. Things happen and it just means people shouldn't be together anymore. They stop being good for each other and then it's best to end it before things get really bad. Hmm? 
Don't worry, you guys can still work this out. Hmm. My dear, you can't believe what happened here today. What happened? You see this Damala? He's not giving up anytime soon. <laughs> this man came here shouting and barking like a mad dog that he wants to talk. Uh, like he wants to talk. I hope you did not let him in. Am I mad to allow Damala in? Very good. I told him that if I see him here again in future, tomorrow, <laughs> I'll call the estate security on him. Very good. Hmm. You see these men at school with them and they take you for granted. Obviously. See, next time, call the police on him. Accuse him of domestic abuse against you and Ludi. They will not only arrest him. By the time he's out, you'll be getting a restraining order. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This is too extreme and harsh now. I should restrain Damola and accuse him of domestic abuse. Uh, now. How about, I, at least I have hearts. See, if you don't deal with this man, they will not stop intimidating you as a woman. I'm serious. I'm not doing this one. Never. Be there. So what's up? Any information about your estate? The robbery uh, incident? About the robbery. Hmm. You know they robbed a lot of houses in the yeah, estate. Yeah, you said so. And, um, James is not yet back from his business trip. So, so bad. I can't really go back there with the kids. What if these people hit again? And can you imagine that they did not even catch one person? Hi. So this bed house tied to your estate is... Chicken. It's not a problem, don't worry. You see, my house is your house. So feel free and make yourself comfortable. Thank Let you. Let me go and prepare dinner for you, ah. okay? Please, rice and turkey. Ah, anything for you. <laughs> Thank you. Rachel, where are you going? I'm leaving. I'm leaving. You don't even have my time. Since I came here, you've not had one single time for me, Damola. It's either your daughter this or your ex-wife this. I can't take it anymore. Let me just go. Listen, Frank, if you know you are here because of Damola, just know that I'm never, never changing my mind. My mind is made up, and that's final. <laughs> well, far from that, Cynthia. Damola doesn't know that I'm here. Okay. And if he's aware that I'm here, it's going to be so cross to me. So, why are you here? That guy is suffering. See, Cynthia, he's suffering. I still don't get how he's my business. It's your business, Cynthia. He was your husband. You love him, obviously. And he loves you. Don't forget, you both have Luli. So it's your business. Listen, Frank, I see you are not ready to talk. Because I don't have all day. I'm quite busy. Cynthia, Damola loves his daughter. Why are you keeping this girl away from him? I'm keeping my daughter because Damola is not a responsible father. I can't let my daughter suffer an abuse. Not when I'm still alive. Never! It can never happen. An abuse? How do you mean? Oh, I see. He didn't tell you. No. Mm -hmm. He only told me you want to elope abroad with your boyfriend mm -hmm. and my daughter. Mm -hmm. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This is the third time I'm hearing this. This is abroad, boyfriend. Traveling with my daughter, I don't get it. They're all lies. I'm going nowhere. I'm here with my daughter. But you see, I'm taking my daughter away from Damola. I'm fed up. We are done. Cynthia, you won't be fair. You won't be fair to Damola. I would just advise you to work it out. He's not ready for any legal battle. He's even dropping any charges and every charges. He, he believes you can still work out things together. Why not just give this a chance? Frank, please take this back to him. My mind is 
made up. Listen to me carefully. I said my mind is made up. I'm done. See you in court in case you guys are ready. From the looks of things, I know you still love him. Just get me a bottle of water. We'll, we'll still discuss this. Even after this, my mind was full. I'm not saying. Are you expecting more than me? It will be that bad luck. Gamola, what is this? You don't want to leave me alone? Eh? We should just come. You want to bring down my door? I'm coming. I don't know if I'm lonely. Man, am, am I the first one that divorced the old bunch? That. Jeez. Oh, you're here. You think you can run away from me? You think you can run forever? Huh? Oh, yeah. Let's go. What's going on? Let's go home. What's Wait. going on? James, you're hurting her. Let's go no, home. Please. What's going on? What's happening? No. What's happening? Are you back for your trip? Move it. What kind of drama is this? Jesus Christ. Isn't James supposed to be in Paris? Nah, 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 I can't believe this. This is really strange. Really, really strange. Ah. Something is wrong. Where is she? Oh, I was taking her to the hospital. The doctor assured me she's fine. But she's just still coughing and trying up. She's been asking of you. Is she okay? She's fine. Thank she's you in her room. Me. I can go and see her, right? Yeah, you can. very healthy to me. I thought mommy said you were sick. I just wanted to see you. So you lied to her that you are sick? I'm sorry, please don't tell her. Come on, sweetie, that's not a good thing to do. I'm sorry, I just missed you. I just wanted to see you. Please don't tell her. Look, as long as you promise not to do this again, I won't tell her. I promise. But you almost gave me a heart attack. I'm sorry. Okay, Bob, can you pass the nurse, please? Well, I'd love to, but I don't think your mom will agree, and I don't want her to get mad at well, me. Well, mom thinks I'm sick. Obviously, she'll agree. Please, Mr. Bonnie says please. Okay, please. okay, okay, but I have to ask her first. Okay. Yes means two. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. So you're welcome, Mr. Bunny. You're welcome, Mr. Bunny. <laughs> I missed you. Um. Doris, 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 sweet. Make it make sense now. Nah. I'm not understanding. I just explain very well. I, I'm not understanding. I'm not following. Cynthia, please. I'm sorry. Okay. okay. Please help me. I can't go back to that house. James will kill me. Okay. James beats me at every slightest provocation. James? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Wait. Cynthia, we go. Wait, wait. I, 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 I want to understand. Are you saying that all those vacation trips, Paris trips, the monthly salary, five million, 
Elder, James is an abusive husband. Hey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're a bad friend, Doris. I trusted you. What kind of friend are you? You painted a picture of a perfect marriage that you had. You convinced me that Damola was not even doing enough for me. You made me find fault in everything he did. And you call yourself my friend. Cynthia, I'm ashamed you of myself. You call yourself my friend, Doris. I'm ashamed of myself. I was so jealous of you. Cynthia. Hey! Please. I'm sorry. Please, I can't go anywhere. See, I don't have any. You're the only family I have, Cynthia. Please family. Family does not cheat on each other. We are no family. Now, quietly leave my house. Cynthia, please. Hey. Doris, I said, leave her now! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Go. Come on, go! 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 Cheers. Okay. Cheers. Let's do it together. Cheers. Damola, you know you're supposed to be leaving immediately after dinner, right? I actually wanted to stay until she feels better before I leave. You know that's not possible. I'll take care of her. Please. Okay, fine, fine. But you're leaving first thing tomorrow morning. Mommy, please. Okay, I changed my mind. I am not going to live until things are the way they used to be. And I also want shared custody of my daughter. Sweetheart, please, can you excuse us? Okay. Give me a chair as well, you're here. Cynthia, why don't you want me to be in my daughter's life? Why are you trying to take her away from me? Did I do anything to you? Or is it because of your boyfriend? Is he better than me? What boyfriend are you always talking about? Oh, please, save me. I already know about it. Your friend told me that you have a boyfriend. I just didn't want to keep it, so I decided to tell you. And why would you decide to relocate with your boyfriend and my daughter to somewhere else without telling me the father of the child? Do you think that's fair? My friend, you're talking about Doris, obviously. Yes. She lied. What do you mean by she lied? Because apparently she lied about everything. She never wanted us together. And why would she lie to me about that? I can't believe I trusted her. I never wanted to divorce you. Of course, when I had Luli and you weren't there, she made me believe that you were cheating on me. I believe that because we're apart from each other, we sleep in separate rooms. You couldn't even touch me, look at me. I felt you were disgusted by my body. Look, Cynthia, how could you even think this about me? How? Look, I was in love with you. The only reason why I stayed in a separate room was because of work. And because Luli was always crying. And I needed the space. And that was the reason why I slept in a separate room. And look, your body does not irritate me. You went through all this to give birth to our child. 
How can I possibly hate you for that? Or hate your brother? I was gonna ask you something. Yes. Did you ever cheat on me? Did I ever cheat? No, I didn't. Look, I told you before when you asked me, and I told you that I never cheated on you, but you never did believe me. Was that the reason why you were distant from me? Was that the reason why you wanted a divorce? The only reason why I agreed to sign that divorce paper was because I thought you were tired of me. And I thought you wanted space. And I only did that to make you happy. To make me happy? I'm not happy. I've never been happy. I should have listened to her. I should have trusted you instead. I'm so sorry. It's okay. 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 to find that the most successful human families in the earliest eras were based on family units that situated grandmothers at the center. The family structure found in many parts of Africa. Wait, I don't understand a thing you're saying. <laughs> you want to read another book? <laughs> okay, let's go to the next page. Things drastically changed with the advent of the colonial masters who unshred in a new social structure that reversed the Wait, role. wait, wait. I still don't understand this one. Okay, let's read from the 21st century. Okay, yeah. I kind of think someone is getting grumpy right now. Okay, so we're going to keep this. We'll get this. What are you doing? <laughs> are you serious no, right now? No. Are, you, are, you, are you serious right now? No. Are you serious? Are you serious, are you serious right now? We're going to put on the bed. <laughs> Are you serious right now? You're going to fall on the bed. Seems like people are having fun. Um, we're not really having any fun. It's time to go to bed. <laughs> oh, okay. Day school tomorrow. I can't see some of this thing grumpy. Yeah, she's getting grumpy. Who's the grumpy, grumpy one here? <laughs> Was it crazy? I think it's time to go. Let's Stop it! You yeah. both are crazy. Okay, it's time to go to bed. It's no. time to go to bed. You go to bed. Get ready to sleep. No. Right, You'll be so getting okay, grumpy. Okay, Don't worry. You have all the time in the world tomorrow. It's time for you to go to bed. Okay, Sulu. Good night, baby. The only way I will sleep if I, is if I have some coffee. Just Who drinks that? coffee at night? Put your head in. Just that. We'll get you a glass of milk, okay? Well, milk makes me sleep. Isn't that the point? No, coffee makes me stay awake, even though I sleep all night. Just right. sleep so you can wake up on time tomorrow. Good night, baby. Hi, <laughs> right, sweetie. Thank you. Don't go. Good night, okay? Good night. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. You know what you're like? Let me see that you. Hello, Damala. This is this is this is good news. So how were you able to convince her into doing this? We talked and we realized we were lied to by the same friend who talked to her into doing it in the first place. There's no boyfriend anywhere, and she wasn't even planning to move abroad. It all lies to keep us apart. I'm so I'm so happy to hear this. So are you guys coming back together? Strange, that's strange. But have you have you asked her? Did you ask her? You never can tell. Things are better of the way they are right now. Anyways, thanks for your love, man. I'm very grateful. Bro. Anytime, Damala. I'm so happy for you and Cynthia. This is just what I want to hear. It's good news. So when you come around, we'll we'll, we'll party to this, man. You're welcome, bro. Mm. 
Ah, this is good. This is good. Great news. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, sweetheart. Is it my birthday? Yes, it is your birthday. Oh, yes, it is my birthday. <laughs> yes, baby. Okay, so make your wish. Wait, 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 wait. Make your wish and cut the cake. Now cut the cake. Before you cut your cake, make your wish. Hmm, okay. I wish for mommy and daddy to stay together. And I also wish for a copy. And another sibling. Two wishes are enough. You take more wishes on your next birthday. Now okay? cut the cake, baby. Slice and dice. Delicacy. Ew. Here you go. Perfect. Hands are. Ew. Slice and dice. So this is for you. Yay! Here you go. Yum, yum, yum. Yum! This is for mommy. <laughs> <laughs> That's so silly. I know. One for Aww. mommy. Aww. <laughs> I knew you were going to do you that. You both are so silly. I, Trust me. I knew you were going to do that. So, the birthday girl. Are you done? Yeah, this is Hey, I just wanted you to know that I missed this. Me too. I really miss us being a family. Same here. I ruined the beautiful life we had. But listening to an outsider, I should have believed you. I should have trusted you. It's not my fault. You know, I believe that we can still make this work. Because I haven't stopped thinking about you. Same here. So do you think we can get married again? Of course. And this time, we'll make things work. Yeah. I love you too. Thank you.